I have already applied a base coat, so I'm going to take my Sally Hansen Insta Dry Nail Polish in Whirlwind White and paint this all over my nails. I'm only going to do one hand because I don't want to keep all my nails like this, but I'm just going to do the tutorial. So I've put this white all over this hand, and I'm just going to let that dry before I start doing any design. I just did a second coat, and now since I did it pretty sloppily, I'm going to take a Q-tip and nail polish remover and just clean it up. Okay, now that that's done, I'm going to take a toothpick and smash down the tip. And let me close this. I'm taking China Glaze for Audrey, and this is kind of like a muted turquoise. Um, it turns out pretty dull, but it's a really nice color. And I'm going to take my toothpick, and this is the way I do it because I don't want to have to put um, nail polish on the card or a piece of paper. So I'm just going to take my toothpick. I just put it on the wrong side. Um, and I'm going to start to draw horizontal lines, and this is probably the worst part of this nail design because it takes patience and time but I'm um, just like this I'm going to make lines This would be easier with the striper tool, but I don't have one this color, so this is what I have to do, but I don't mind. Sorry, I was just like testing something. Um, I'm done with this color and now I'm finished with the stripes and I'm going to wait for them to dry before I add the anchors. Now that the stripes have dried, I'm going to take Sally Hansen Hard as Nails Extreme Wear in 28 Blackout. Oh, there's a glare. And I'm going to draw the anchors. And like I did with the other side of the toothpick, this is the side I used last time, and this is the one I'm going to use this time, just the other side. I'm going to smash this tip down, too. You don't have to smash it down, but I just like to because if you use the point, it's harder to get more polish on your nail. So I'm going to take my black nail polish and my toothpick and start to draw the anchors. Start by drawing a straight line on the center of your nail and I'm going to face the anchors um, the curvy part right here so that way when I go like like 
this, the anchors are facing toward me. So just start to draw one curved line on that side and then do the same on the other side. And that's crooked. Oh well. I'm not too careful with this because I'm not going to keep it. And then draw one line across the top. And then from there, draw a line. I You can just draw the line first that way and then do a cross that way. But I like to do this part and then draw the rest of the anchor. So that's the first nail. And I'm going to do that to the rest of my nails. You can talk. I finished drawing all of the anchors and that is it for the designing and you can always add a top coat but since I'm not going to keep this on my nails I won't but kind of messed up on the pinky but that's all right so this is the design and I hope you guys enjoyed and if you want to see more tutorials subscribe or you can request tutorials in the comments I hope you guys enjoyed and thanks for watching.